Hello, I'm Sally. Welcome to my channel. I'm here with another presentation video of our beautiful prefab house, guys. Today, our 83 square meter prefab house you see behind me, I will introduce you as much as I can, show you around the materials used, and you have asked me a lot to. I'll try to answer a few questions in this video, guys. Subtitle as you can see, the roof of our building actually green metal tiles were used and as you can see on the roof there are now solar panels we have a customer in this building meets its electricity needs with solar panels guys Subtitle before MK. starting the video if you subscribe to my channel from the bottom right and open the notifications by pressing the bell button you will be aware of such upcoming videos friends before we start the video now that i've made this announcement let's start our video friends yes friends our 83 square meter prefabricated house is like this reported Just image like this. we have a dome protrusion on the left side our roof is made of green metal tile green tile like sheets insulation of double layer hearth in the attic has been made this customer of ours used a solar panel on our roof friends who will meet their electricity needs with solar panels let's approach our building like this wood pattern siding was applied to the front facade of our building. There was no cladding process on our side and rear facades. No friends, this is something you can choose optionally. It's about the cost price. Uh, so these are my rear and side facades. Uh, whether it looked plain or had a wood pattern wasn't very important. Only siding was applied to the front facade, naturally, affecting the price. Hey buddies from the rooftops, the interior and exterior paints of our building have been done. Rain gutters, the discharge of rain gutters to the ground is complete. For it's done folks, light grey and dark grey colors we worked on in our building. You completely own these colors, you know how to choose friends. Subtitles by MK. Say. Okay. Subtitle by you choose uh, the color of the building, the color of the roof, the design of the building, the number of rooms, the number of doors and windows, their sizes, the colors of the doors and windows are completely... You can choose. Nice. You completely design your factory house, friends. Let's slowly move into our building like this, folks. Bye-bye. Yes, folks, when we enter through the steel door like this, a spacious kitchen living room greets us immediately to our left. This is how the lounge section looks. 26 square meters is a section allocated only for the living room part. One of the common questions you ask is how do prefab houses heat? What do they heat with? As you can see here, with the stove, or alternatively, radiator or natural gas, or on the floor heating or air conditioning. This is entirely up to you folks. You can heat your building with any heating method you want. Our client places his stove in front of our dome protrusion here. On this side, there's the TV, etc. By designing seating arrangements, here he creates his own living space. Right on the right side of our steel door, that is in the continuation of our living room. We have a kitchen area of 14 square meters. Here you can see our kitchen cabinets are installed. Advanced rough assembly was made in this building. Our customer has done processes like kitchen cabinets, ceramics, laminate flooring by himself. There is a little man here. Uh, right next to it is the kitchen cabinet counter area. I want to mention another event right here. Electricity is produced with solar panels. As you can see, the inverters here. In this cupboard and also at the bottom, we have batteries. The cable goes from here to our fuse box, then connects the electricity to the building as you can see here, we have our batteries in the red and black cable. 
our batteries and inverter are getting power from the panels then it comes out from the inverter the fuses in our fuse box also distribute electricity to the building focus our customers who struggle with electricity due to electricity shortage subscription to electricity or distance to the electricity line can do this way with solar panel systems it can cater to electrical needs our customer run his mini fridge with the electricity system he set up here provided that he did not keep it on for a long time products such as kettles you can use such products of course this is for the water heater washing machine or it's an oven it won't meet these kinds of needs but of course if you want it can meet all the needs of the house like this you can also install solar panel systems friends actually it's dependence on the outside the solar panel is quite practical and in my opinion it's a nice electricity that cuts off the dependence on the outside usage tool right across from the living room and kitchen is the toilet bathroom areas our toilet bathroom area is five square meters of course the shower cabin toilet area sink area these are being made new the shower area toilet area sink area and next to the sink a section for a washing machine is also allocated friends titles when we come out of the bathroom we have a room on our left that is 14 square meters as i mentioned our lamp switches are working right now electricity is being generated with solar panel system electricity is being consumed in this building right now our customer also had roller blinds installed and the curtains are now in place in our building we have uh, for drywall lining and plastering on the inner facade the walls are entirely you can see our joining elements you don't see the slats a plain look has been given friends again our doors are a dopam brand a dopam's doors our doors are wood on the inside and covered with pvc on the outside here our customer might say brown or plain white he chose a door in shades that lean a bit towards gray of course as i said you can optionally choose your doors windows colors sizes friends you can completely design your prefab house after leaving this room there's another one right across yeah we have a bedroom of about 15 square meters let me show you this room in a broad sense raw strawberry bed uh, cupboard spaces and fields like ATCR can be easily handled with pot friends with during this way. Yes, guys, our prefabricated house presentation video was like this too. The operations we do in our building, the number of rooms, the doors and windows. I tried to explain the material used as much as I could, friends. As I mentioned in the video while touring the building, as I mentioned, you are designing your building completely by yourself, friends, friends. So after deciding your project with you here, plaster coating and yalipan coating in your building. Subtitles, okay. It didn't seem flat either. We are leaving this to you as an option. So you can design it entirely by yourself. Usually one of the most frequently asked questions is if you do turnkey. This is optional, friends. So if you want a turnkey building, turnkey, if you want a rough building, go ahead. What is this rough forward event? We will get three pencil works in the building. The base metaphor, the difference between laminate and ceramic and the kitchen, will take over the cabinet counter business. Apart from this, the installation of the building, interior and exterior paint, door, pendulum, lamp, socket, the toilet stone, sink water, faucet steps belong to us. Similarly, transportation, accommodation, assembly costs are also ours. But if you want turnkey, your chosen ceramics, your chosen laminate, your chosen floor elevation, your kitchen of choice, prices vary according to the counter. In other words, in terms of quality and pattern, 
In terms of uh, decoration, these are entirely relative and fluctuating price products. We offer these to you as optional. We present to you friends. Our 83 square meter prefabricated house was like this. Two plus one design with an open kitchen living room. I prepared a presentation video for you in this way as much as I could. Friends, if you liked my video, don't forget to press the like button. If you enjoy such videos, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications by clicking the bell button. Goodbye. Goodbye. Enjoy watching.